popping All in my phone, I got options And I don't wanna tell you to drop it But I don't wanna play your face Hi queens, welcome back to my channel or if you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Eva. If you like all things luxury hauls, luxury unboxings, fashion hauls, luxury gift guides, then you're in the right place. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and give this video a big thumbs up. So as you guys can tell by the title of today's video, I'm going to be doing a what I got for my 27th birthday mini Hermes luxury unboxing haul. I recently turned 27 on June 20th and it's just so insane i feel like i was comfortable with 25 i was comfortable with 26 even though i was like eh but like 27 like i don't know i don't know how to feel about 27. i'm trying to just accept it with grace and you know embrace it and live it i'm very grateful for my 27 years here on earth and i have so much more to look forward to and happening in my future that i'm very excited for so yeah yesterday was june 25th it's june 26th today it's monday but yesterday was kind of like the celebration and all like the birthday festivities and antics so i went to a hotel with my good friend and my fiance and you know we had some birthday shots we went in the pool we went in the jacuzzi it was really nice i had a little bit too much to drink so i really didn't get as much content as I would have liked but as you saw in the opening of the video we did go to a castle for my birthday dinner and it was stunning so if you are ever in the Long Island area definitely recommend I will leave it linked down below in the description check out the website if you're ever in the Long Island area and you're in Suffolk County and you want to check it out it's a very popular wedding destination but they do have a restaurant speaking of weddings and fiancés I recently became a fiance so even though this is not a birthday gift Gift. I did just get engaged on May 21st so who doesn't love some diamonds for their birthday so even though it's separate of course um, it's just like a Mount Cloud Nine it kind of feels like a little extra birthday gift I'll put in some photos my fiance but my boyfriend at the time took me to a really beautiful beach and he had like a luxury picnic set up and um, it was a surprise my parents ended up being there our kids ended up being there my best friend they all carried out the marry me little letters and lined up where it said marry me it was simple romantic beautiful and on the beach which is exactly what I wanted so I am very happy and yeah it's kind of just like a little extra birthday gift but yeah guys I know you're all here for the haul so let's get into the haul just a quick disclaimer I'm not gonna be unboxing any Birkins no Aran sandals not even jewelry okay like we are just not there yet but like I love to incorporate luxury into my life in affordable ways so everything that I will show you guys will be linked down below in the description box these make great gifts this is kind of like a luxury gift guide because I think everything in this haul is under $200 so be sure you check out the links in the description box let's get started Started. I'm gonna start with this bag right here so in this bag I have two items in here and I did purchase everything online my friends were kind enough to like send me the money and let me buy my gift what I wanted same with my fiance so that's what I did but in this little Hermes bag first item I'm gonna share is this little item in this box a lot of designer brands like chanel dior gucci ysl they all have other lines besides just ready to wear bags and shoes like check out their um, beauty lines skincare makeup and home good lines because you might be able to find some good steals like cute pieces so this is from the hermes beauty line if you are familiar with their makeup you probably already know what this is this is actually a little gift from me to myself 
So the way this opens is the box kind of slides out like this. And then the items in this little dust bag. And then here you have the little like Hermes logo. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's got a really pretty like design here. And in this little dust bag is a lipstick. So this is the color Rose Tan, it's number 49, and all their lipsticks come in this like tri-colored packaging. I love that I have like this pretty pink at the bottom of mine. So it opens like this, and this is the lipstick. So I don't know if you guys can see, but it does say Hermes on the lipstick. Sorry if it's not focusing, but it says Hermes, and I'm not gonna, I guess I'll swatch it for you guys. It is very light, which I actually like, so... I'm pretty tan, so that's why like it's not showing up as good on my hands. But on my lips, it does show up, but it is a lighter color. So even though it looks like a darker, I guess, mauve kind of color, it comes out pretty light and it's like a light nude. And yeah, this is a really cute little gift. I'm happy that I got it. I'm actually wearing it right now, but I have some Dior gloss over it and lip liner. Um, but it is a cute little gift. This would make a great stocking stuffer gift or just... A gift for someone it was a little pricey for a lipstick almost a hundred dollars is a bit crazy for a lipstick probably the most expensive designer lipstick but it is really a cute little gift so that's what I gifted myself all right next I'm going to move on to this box here this is from my good friend um, Tanasia the girl I was at the hotel with and she got me this gift set I see this item in a lot of the luxury gift guide videos for items under a hundred dollars so let's unbox her. Taking off the ribbon. And in here. This is what I got from her. So this is the Hermes soap gift set. And I love it. You can order this online. You can choose three different scents. You can choose all the same scents, but when you purchase this online, you get to pick from various different soaps. And some of the soaps um, they do have in the scents that they carry their perfumes in. But let me just go over each of the names of the soaps with you guys. So this one is the EU de Orange Verte. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but I'll put the name on the screen. This is what it looks like. This is the back with the name of it. They all come in like their own little packaging. It says Hermes Paris on them. So these are great gifts. One thing I will say about the Hermes soaps is that I have very sensitive skin when it comes to makeup and skincare and I have no issues with the soap. They last very long, they smell really good and I have no issues with them. This is the second one. This is the Un Jardin. They all look the same when you take them out of the box in the circle. The last one is the Iode Basilic. I don't know, Potpourri. Sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong again. I'm just gonna put it on the screen. But they're stunning. They just smell so, so good. So the orangey one, I'm not the biggest fan of orange. It's a little unisex to me, so it's a little bit more masculine, um, but it does smell really good. It smells like orange. And then the Oom Jardin, it's very fresh and clean, which I love. And then this one is also very fresh and clean, but it also gives me like vacation, tropical vibes. So um, I like this one a lot too. Thank you to my girl, Tanasia, for this beautiful gift. And I can't wait to use my soaps. Okay, so the last item I have in this bag, like I mentioned before, when you get the soaps, it's just a great way to experience the fragrance before investing into the full-size perfume. And here, I do have a fragrance. This is from my best friend, Tiffany, and it is none other than the very popular Twilly Day Hermes perfume. So it did come wrapped in plastic, but I went ahead and opened it and smelled it, and it opens like this. And this is the bottle, it's so cute. And what I love is that it has a little twilly on it. So this fragrance, I guess it's sort of like their main fragrance, 
but it's very controversial. Not everyone loves it. I really just wanted to have it in my designer perfume collection. I feel like it's a must with the little twilly on it. I mean, it's just so Hermes. It's very powdery, so it does smell like powder, like baby powder, or like a powder-like scent, and like, it does smell more mature. If you're going for like batty boss type of vibes or young and sexy, this is definitely not it, but it's nice to have a perfume that's a little bit more mature in my collection, and I just feel like the Twilly perfume with the little Twilly is like a must have in your little collection. So if you collect designer fragrances, I still recommend it. Thank you to my best friend for getting it for me. Okay, so next we're gonna get into this one right here. This is from my fiance. Um, the last two are from him. This is actually from their home line. And with Hermes, I was really surprised because I was gonna get like a doll Twilly and stuff, but I just, they just didn't have any patterns that I really loved online. Like, I guess you have to have a whole essay to get more like designs and stuff offered to you. But I was like, you know what? I'd rather wait until I can get a full size one from a brand in a pattern that I actually really, really like than spend all that money or have someone spend all that money on it. But anyways, this, like I said, is from the Homeware line. I'm just gonna open it. And this is the Hermes pop-up coffee table book. So I've been wanting to start my designer coffee table book collection. And so this is the very first. This is a very popular book um, by Hermes. You can get on the website. It's actually super affordable. And I'm obsessed. I do plan to put this you know, just underneath my flowers on my dresser or when I have a table in my living room or wherever, my foyer one day when I buy a house. So this is the start. This is what it looks like on the side. So when you place like stuff on top of it, that's what it'll look like. When you open it, it's all pop up. And you've got ones like this. And it's just got details about Hermes, some moving ones as well so you can like pull a little tab and some more beautiful pop-up pictures so i love this thank you to my fiance for the coffee table book okay so the last item in this big box no it's not shoes or a bag this item's kind of silly but honestly for summer it's perfect i actually just watched like two other luxury unboxings and both girls got the same item just from like a different brand i think one got hers from Loewe, and then i forgot the other brand but um i'm actually really excited for this piece so this is the beautiful box Take off the ribbon. And inside this box, the nice tissue. And the item does come in a dust bag, which I was really happy to get. But if you cannot guess what it is, this is my new Hermes beach towel. How freaking cute. So this is the stairs towel in, um, I believe the color hibiscus. Got the little Hermes tag right here. And this is the pattern. It's so pretty. I actually have the matching um, hand towel. I use it just as a face washcloth for after I do my skincare but it is super big, like really big. It opens again and it's just got the stairs H pattern. It's super soft and I'm obsessed. Like I cannot wait to bring this to the pool. It matches my new beach bag that I just got. So I'm really excited, but I love it. It's got the little Hermes tag right here. And yeah, this is my last gift. So thank you to my fiance. Thank you to my wonderful friends. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Check out Okina Castle. It'll be linked down below. Check out all of the items. I have them linked like I mentioned. Um, they make great gifts. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next haul. Bye queens.